Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be talking about the Three Pigeons Tactical Range Backpack. Now this thing is packed full of features. It's awesome. So let's dive into this thing and see exactly what you're getting. All right, so a little bit about this bag is it's 1000 denier nylon. So what that means is this thing is very, very durable. This nylon is super strong. If you're prone to th kind of throwing your gear around like I am, um, a lot of these cheaper bags will rip and start to fray and tear apart. With this 1000 denier uh, nylon, you shouldn't have that issue unless you're just really, really abusing that thing, but really tough stuff. Um, want to go into the zippers real quick. So these are very heavy duty zippers. Um, they're also wrapped in this rubber on the ends here, which is a very nice feature because these knots tend to come undone and your uh, Your paracord here will tend to just kind of fray apart and then you're retying those things six seven times You know just to get them to stay and these are very heavy duty zippers and every zipper on this pack locks together now that's a cool feature one not just for security but some states require that when you're transporting firearms that they be in a locked container. So this fits that bill. It's a container, it locks, and it stores your firearms and all your range gear. So let's, uh, let's keep going into this thing. So it does have a nice carry handle here. That's always a good feature, um, you know, especially when you're at the range and you kind of move from spot to spot. You don't want to throw it on your back every single time just to move five feet. So carrying handle, very good option. All right. A lot of little uh, carabiner spots where you can hook your stuff up right there in the front on the side here also the side over here if you wanted to run a hydration pouch you could also run those through here to keep it kind of near where your uh, mouth would be so good feature all right let's start diving in to the pack itself so right up front you've got a few compartments that we're going to go through so you can kind of set this up however you want i'm just going to try to show you what all you can fit in this bag so in this front pocket here, I like to keep my uh, rifle cleaning gear, some hearing protection, extra flashlight in case it starts to get dark. And then I've got a uh, lens brush and some CLP just to kind of, you know, keep myself up and running while I'm out there on the range. Um, this bottom section here. All right, so I got all my, my tools for the range. So I got a multi-tool, stapler, extra staples, and typically I have some other stuff in here, but right now, I do not, so there's that. <laughs> um, all right, so we have a, another side compartment right here. So on this little flat piece, I have uh, just some note-taking gear, a bunch of uh, pens and markers and stuff, because you never know, you know, when you need to mark targets, take some notes, make adjustments uh, to your optics, and just note those wind call changes and things like that. All right, up here, I've got plenty of space to store extra mags, whatever the heck whatever the heck you want to throw up here that's just what i got all right next big pouch here you know you got a whole big old ammo ammo can full of ammo that fits there awesome now these compartments will go all the way down um, but if you look i currently have mine set up to where this is blocked off but all you do is take this inner compartment out and then all this stuff will fold down and then you'll have one big you know, traditional backpack. But I'll show you why I didn't want it set up like that. And uh, I think you're gonna think it's pretty cool. So, all right, this next pouch over here, check that out. So direct access to the bottom of the bag. So you can see why I set it up to where half of the bag is storage for ammo, mags and things like that. Because this bottom part right here I can store three handguns and these cases are all included with this bag. So I'm gonna break it down for you real quick. So here I have a uh, revolver in here. And then if it wasn't a revolver, maybe I had some extra loaded, uh, some speed loaders or whatever. It holds four mags on this other side and it's got this nice little protective uh, sleeve between the two so you don't scratch your weapons up for you, uh, for you princess uh, safe queens out there and then go ahead and slide it right back in. Next, what do we got here? You can fit a full size uh, 1911 in, the, uh, in these uh, cases. And then again, room for four mags. I got three in there because, well, I'm a peasant, so there's that. And then lastly, what do we got? 
All right, so we got four four mags. All right, cool. And I'm gonna go ahead and secure that. I don't think I went over that in the last two. So this flap here will secure so that way it doesn't slide out of the way and expose your uh, weapon to getting scratched up. So I don't have anything in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw this uh, PSA dagger in here. Boom. All right, and then everything's loaded up. I am good to go. All right, then again, these zippers lock together, throw a padlock on there, whatever the case may be, and we are good. Now, moving to the back side, we have nice, nice padded shoulder straps, and this mesh is breathable, so I know if you're like me, you wear backpacks, they kind of make you sweat a lot, and if it's super hot outside, nothing's going to mitigate that, but this aids and not only breathability, but also comfort. Like these things have a nice bit of cushion to them. In addition to that, you have this nice little chest strap here. So I'll throw this on in a minute and uh, demonstrate, but that keeps it nice and tight to your chest so your bag's not flopping all around, especially if you got a loaded gear in here. All right, so this back uh, plate here, you see how it's got this bolstered padding? Let me try to get the side angle there. So this bolstered padding gives you a lot of cushion, so it's gonna be super comfortable on your back, which is awesome. And it also has that on that lower uh, lumbar support there. This keeps, this, the, the, the features just keep coming. <laughs> so in addition to that, we've got the, uh, the waist strap here, which again, keeps all that weight centered over your hips, not your shoulders, which relieves a lot of that pressure off of your, your uh, upper shoulders and your back, because if you're uh, hiking to a spot or, you know, where you park to where the actual shooting portion of the range is could be quite a distance. Obviously, you don't want to have that strain on your back right before you're going to shoot because then it's just, you know, it's, it's, it's uncomfortable. And for us older folks, it makes the day just a little bit uh, unpleasant. So let's go ahead and throw this bad boy on. Now, you don't have to run that uh, waist strap. You could tuck it out of the way if you want to, but it's there in case you want to use it. So I've got a fully loaded backpack here, three pistols, bunch of AR mags, bunch of extra ammo for my, uh, for my handguns and all my PPE here and protection, all that stuff. So yeah, this thing is pretty schnazzy, does exactly what you needed to do. Um, a lot of guys have the big duffel bag style range bags. I have a couple of those uh, style range bags and they're good for what they are, but this is just a lot more convenient to just throw on your back and be able to have, be hands-free and go. And uh, again, and maybe you're doing a little bit of hiking in addition to uh, going to the range, you have your hands free to kind of do whatever you need to do. If you're carrying an AR um, or you have another rifle case to carry an AR with you, then you know, you're not having a million bags in your hands and you, you just kind of defenseless. So kind of cool. Um, I think it was awesome. So uh, let me know what you guys kind of, think about this bag. I think it's awesome. In addition to that, it's also got some Velcro for all your cool guy pouches and laser stitched uh, mo molly all over the bag. So you got room for pretty much any accessory you could want to bring with you, anything you could want to throw on the outside of the bag. This thing is going to do it all. And uh, three pinches, I think, got it right. So in this video description, I'm gonna leave the link to this bag, and I'm also gonna to leave to a link to two other products that uh, are by Three Pigeons, and uh, I think you're gonna be uh, pretty happy with those as well, so go ahead and check it out, and uh, like, comment, subscribe, and uh, consider sharing this content with uh, your buddies so they can see what a great bag they have here. So, appreciate you guys, Till next time.